This is a little freeform poem I wrote about six, eight months back. It's called My Blade. <clears throat> the crickets chirp. The dog barks in the distance. The cat calls out to their brother for the midnight delight. The moon and starlight catch a gleam of my polished blade swirling around in the night, dancing and singing its beautiful song, a song that has enticed the ear of man since iron was forged from the fires of hell to make steel, the very steel that my blade was forged from. Ever since I looked upon the beauty of my blade, it spoke to me, a simple phrase that only I was made to understand, a phrase spoken in blood. An accidental slice of my fingertips, and it said to me, don't tread on me. A simple command, a command that even I, the, word, the sword's supposed master, cannot disobey. And now, here we are, dancing in the midnight, forever bound by blood and by creed. It sings to me. It tells me to hold it, to never let it go. It says to me, hold me, and I will protect you. Keep me, and you will live to see glory. Love me, and I will not forsake you. Betray me and you will suffer the fate that thousands before you have suffered. I swing my blade through the air, stringing along a chord in its glorious melody. The sound helps me clear my mind and purifies my soul, telling me that I am still alive. The wind cools my skin as the, as the blade pushes me faster and faster. With each cut, I begin to see the truth in all things. The shades of gray separate once more and become black and white. Now I see the beauty in the world. But sadly, all things must come to an end. The song comes to an abrupt end. The dance is over and I house my blade. The lines become blurred. My thoughts become clouded once more. And all that is left is the sweat and the memory of the time we shared. My blade cries to me, free me. Tears swell in my eyes as I come back to the real world. I hear the dogs barking and the crickets chirping again. The cycle of life continues. And my blade waits until the next time she can sing once more. Thank you.